Hello everyone, uh, this is Steve. Uh, welcome back to our Lightning Curfew Chapter 2 uh, for Arctic Warfare. Lightning Curfew 2. Uh, let's hop into in this map. So, uh, let me talk about the comp first, alright? Let's bring up the NJ, bbs.nj.cn. It's a pretty useful website. I always use that when I play in CN server. And, uh, here is their way to clear them out. So you deploy one only. You need only one team for it. So at least uh, one team is for level seventy, and the recommended would be two rifle, one AR with sixteen. Uh, the with the sixteen. Uh, what's that? The buckles, buckles ammo. Yeah, the buckles ammo is the reward for this stage. And then you deploy your. Uh, Echelons from the, your command post. You go all the way to the right and go down right there. And then what you do is uh, you see. Mm, oh, they are telling you how to avoid the Jupiters. So if you see this, uh, this is like a red dot right here, like over here. Uh, you don't go if you see a Jupiter right here you try to avoid it you have to go all the way around like this and this, this there are a couple like uh, resupply knots uh, this resupply knots you cannot use it since it's all red and surrounded by all red you cannot capture this one so for this one you probably can capture and uh, get resupply right here and go all the way around it to the command post so if uh the way I'm gonna show is to for people who hate hate going all the way around it and uh, people who want to challenge the Jupiters, you can watch how I play it. Um, usually I just uh, go this way. The, the second one, like uh, I just kill the Jupiters and go, get, go all the way to the command post. I found that this is much easier. Alright, so... Alright, let's hop into the map. Team mode looks like uh, the same as the last one. Alright. Um, one AR, one rifle. Okay, gotta cancel that and start operation. Mm, I gotta sub summon another team out. Uh, AR teams. Uh, I cannot see my AR teams. <laughs> okay, gotta resupply right here. Uh, mm, interesting, huh? Go here, go there. Go to the front. Uh, I don't need to kite. I think for my for my teams, they are they are too strong. I think. If you have like link four, you probably will be suffer. I don't know. I never use link four because <laughs> I don't have link four team. <laughs> okay. Uh, I think uh, these are these two are all Jupiters, right? Yeah. And I gotta end my turns right here. Okay, this enemies don't use rifles. Try to use ARs. It's much easier. Hmm. Yeah, I think a link four is doable. Yeah, for this enemy, uh, you don't need to kite or anything. They are pretty easy though. I'm gonna catch up my rifle teams right here. Move down my rifle teams. And see if I can switch that. Move forward. Oh, no enemies. Nice. Gotta deal with that Jupiters. Not sure if the Jupiter's there. Okay, it's still there. Huh. Select. Uh, we got five Jupiters right here. Yeah. Okay. 
Nice, nice. My world is just uh, taking ba very bad damage, but anyway, we get through this. Uh, so I'm gonna capture this uh, heli port to resupply my teams, both of my teams. Um, and uh, that armored cannon, cannon uh, will be facing my rifle teams. They will be damaged so hard. <laughs> Move Kalipo to the front. And uh, here's another trick I want to show you. Like uh, when, um, sorry to pause right here. So once you try to want to your AOs try to fight their cannons, you know, like when they first find these like uh, armors, uh, the small mobs in the front, they are pretty tanky and uh, you don't want them rifles to attack. So here's the way I'm gonna show you. You can switch the two teams and, uh, and, uh, and uh, come back, they, they will try to, uh, they will try to shoot the, the, the back one. Maybe that's not clear, I will show you next time. If I found another uh, enemies like that, it takes some skills, I would say. You know, try to switch between your two rifles positions and switch back uh, your two rifles to original point. Uh, they will try to you know change the enemy to attack. They will probably ch uh, they will probably shoot the back one. Oh, another Jupiter's. Interesting. <laughs> Probably take two Jupiter's would be too much for me, but I have no choices. I have to go for it. You know, once you pass this uh, this chapter or this stage, you just only need to repair your uh, use three repair tickets, and you're done with this stage, right? You know that. Hmm. No enemies. Nice. Okay, so another thing I want to tell you is uh, don't try to use machine guns to face this night little mobs. Uh, I forgot what her name is, but I can show you. Uh, there's a website called uh, M O E G R A. Yeah, this one. Moigo.org. Uh, it's in it's in Mandarin, but anyway, I I will show you like uh, their name though. Uh, let's see. SF enemies. The name is uh, Scots. We call them uh, in Chinese. In Chinese, we call them uh, little heliport. Scots. They have very high invasion in night uh, in night battle. So try to use ARs or uh, rifles. I don't think that works just because AR equip night vision equipment. So that's probably why I would say that. Don't use machine gun to face them. Uh, machine gun has very low accuracy, even you add a red dot. Uh, that's the biggest thing I want to tell you. Retreat. If you find your soft machine guns taking too much damage, uh, just retreat them and uh, the enemies will move forward and your AR will be able to kill them uh, instantly. So that's how you minimize your uh, damage taken. Another way would be like this. Move back. Okay, I think that's everything I need to say for this uh, stage. Uh, the lighting curfew too. Uh, this is how you, how I find it. How I see these chapters. How I see this uh, map. Maybe you have an easier way to do it, but it's your decision to pick which one you like. Alright, so I'll see you in the next video, the Lightning Curfew 3.